Hello, my name is Curtis and thank you for tuning in to Burst of Java. Today I'm going to make the perfect cup of coffee right for you in this simple little drip machine right here. And using this grinder with an 8 to 12 cup filter, using our dark rose coffee right here, you can see that. Um, we're actually going to all the pop-up shops here in Fort Lauderdale. We're on BurstofJava.com, we're on Amazon.com, and if you have any social media, we're on it. So go ahead and start following us on all of them and um, let me get started. Uh, if you see these little black bags, this is us, Burst of Java. Best coffee in the world, best tasting. For it's from uh, South America and Indonesia, just came out. It has a nice kick to it, no, no crashing, um, the aroma is great. You gotta see for yourself. This is all I drink right here, all I drink. So let's get started. So right here, I'm not gonna show you that. That's a nice bag right here, I'm not gonna mess that up. So right here, I already have a bag already open. You have a filter. These filters you can get from anywhere. Um, it's like a dollar and change right here. The coffee machine. It's, this is all online. I have links to all this stuff wherever you're looking at. There'll be links for it. Um, so what we want to do, this right here goes in this drip coffee machine right here, this drip coffee maker. You put this like this. You put this in there. And what we're going to do is fill the coffee beans right here up to that line. To the fill line. So, we're going to put that in there. And this has a few settings. It has um, coarse, it has medium, it has fine. Um, I kind of do it to my liking. You can do it to your liking. Um, but for the best taste, my opinion is medium. And I do it twice to just get all the coffee beans grounded. So, and this actually right here, this one has an automatic stop. So, you can just hold this button right here and it'll stop when the coffee beans are done grinding. So, I kind of shake it a little bit to get all those coffee beans grinded. And so we don't have any big coffee beans in the coffee maker. So see, as you can see, it stopped while I was still holding it. So I'm just going to do it one more time just to make sure. Get all those coffee beans. It smells so good. So, good. so that's enough right there. This particular grinder actually detaches like this, and um, you can take the top off pretty easy. That way you can pour all your coffee grinds right into the little coffee maker right here. So it's already set in there. So what we're going to do is just take this, dump the whole thing right in there, just like that. And what I like to do is kind of hit it and shake it, and we're going to have it right there in the middle. So you get that nice brewing of the coffee. And so with this coffee maker, I usually put it at 10, fill the water up to the 10, close it. And this is a Mr. Coffee. I'm not promoting anything like this. This is all on the site though, if you want to see it. Uh, what you can do is just hit the brew button right there. And then you have a strong brew right here if you want it strong. And the aroma will fill the room. So this is our first video for the drip coffee. Um, the next one I'm going to be doing the cure to show you how to do it. You don't necessarily need K-cups to do uh, grinded coffee. We like to use whole bean coffee beans. That's the freshest beans you can use. We don't use grind, grinded beans like I straight out the pack. It, it goes really, really quick. This is the best way. So thank you for tuning in. My name is Curtis and check us out. Please join us on all the social medias. Check out our site. Check us out on Amazon and please get a bag of Versa Java. You will not be disappointed. Thank you. See you soon.